Alright, okay, okay, listen to me, bro. Do you need a jump shot? I might have one for you. I, I really might have one. So, if you guys are looking for the best jump shot in NBA 2K21, you can probably go somewhere else for it. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, everyone posts these types of videos. I'm not gonna cap to you, but, 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 I can promise you one thing, bro. I'm just I can't promise you anything but listen hey in today's video I got you guys with my best jump shot in NBA 2k21 So now that this game is basically dead up until like the three week period before next gen comes out I'm gonna be showing you guys what my best jump shot is So if you guys are interested in that video in this title anything about this video itself y'all can keep watching I'm gonna be showing you guys the jump shot like right off bat so y'all can get the jump shot and then just leave I understand these types of videos get like no retention at all. So that's fine you guys want one thing and one thing only, so I'm gonna provide that like right now. All right, so before I get baked and you guys ask like, what are my credentials? Why do I deserve to be showing you guys a jump shot? Here are a couple games that I've gotten within NBA 2K21, given they're not the best games of all time. But honestly, as a YouTuber, I really don't play 2K as much as I should. But when I do, I make sure to actually play some decent games. Now, hopping into this jump shot, listen, it's like within two minutes. If y'all don't leave a like just for that, I don't know if there's any other reason to leave a like on a jump shot video, but regardless, I want to show you guys my base. My base is going to be jump shot 48 upper release. If you guys know anything about my jump shot videos, you guys know I rock with two releases and two releases only, bro. I use the Larry Bird first release and normally that's going to be it. Um, I can use this regular Larry Bird or sometimes like in this video, I do recommend using Rudy Gay. So now mixing with Larry Bird and Rudy Gay, to be honest, at least for me, this is the most fluid jump shot I've ever created. All right. So for my guards, y'all need to listen up. This is going to be very crucial for strictly guards. If you guys are on a point guard or one through three, y'all are going to want to put your release speed to three, four speed. Now for my big mans of the world, I do recommend putting your release speed on max, but animation blending is going to be very simple though. Put Larry Bird to 60% and put Rudy Gay on 40%. Now, from here, bro, this has been the jump shot in under two minutes. So, y'all can low key dip out now since I gave y'all a jump shot. But I will say, though, if you guys want to learn a couple more things about shooting in NBA 2K21, the badges I use or anything relating to this video, I would recommend to keep watching the video. But regardless, bro, this is where you guys peace out. I'll see you guys whenever I see you guys. So, within my badges now, this is my normal 20 setup for the rec center. I mainly play rec. But this is what I do for park. I usually put green machine down to silver, catch and shoot to gold, and then I kind of mess around. Uh, I usually run hot start on gold and then catch and shoot on gold. I'm a firm believer in catch and shoot. Some people don't like it, but I absolutely love it, especially off of offensive rebounds when they can kick it out and it's just an instant green light. Hot start is such a crucial part in playing park, in my opinion. If you guys have the badges, definitely invest in hot start. Now, let me just preface this by also saying, bro, y'all are about to see me go crazy in this gameplay, but I just want to tell you guys, if you guys do not have a playmaking shot creator, what are y'all doing, bro? This is the go-to build for Park, at least. I run it in Rec as well, but this is the fire build this year. It can shoot, it can dribble. I mean, low-key, you can play a little bit of defense. I'm not going to lie. It's, it's all right, because, you know, low-key with a, a minimum wind span, you're not going to be able to do much, but you're going to be able to hit out like this. I mean, come on, bro. Like... It's that simple. Gets you a dude with Hall of Fame Dimer, Hall of Fame Floor General, and y'all are just going to run stuff so quick, and y'all are going to get the best shooting animations. Listen, the animations that I get with my 91.3, yes, I have a 91.3. You guys are going to be able to green out, especially with the jump shot I just gave y'all. Come on, bro. It's really that simple. I got to say, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I constantly use boost, bro. And even though it's white, it still goes in. Listen. Whites are basically greens, you know what I'm saying? Like, whites in this game, for me at least, they always go in. I'm not going to lie. If they are on the spectrum of that meter, I, I don't know what it is. Honestly, if it really is the jump shot, then geez. But I really don't think it is. I really think in this game, if you have anywhere from like an 80 to a 95.3, then you're automatic. And that's, once you guys get your badges at least, the badges are the biggest thing. I'm not going to cap to you. But even like paired with that jump shot rating of like a 91 with a 3, y'all are set. It, it is really that easy. And if you guys don't have a shooting build, I recommend to make one. And then you guys are going to realize what it's like to actually shoot. Because from my personal experience, having a build with a 71.3, it's pretty hard to shoot. I I'm not going to cap to y'all. It is really hard to shoot. But 
Listen, when you got my build, it does not matter again. I hit so many whites. I have the meter on again for a specific reason, and that is simply I just don't know my jump shot that well yet because I just started using this jump shot, and this is by far my most favorite jump shot. All those wreck screenshots you guys seen, that was within a two day period, and that was with one, the shot meter on, and two, with the boost, I have like a 99 game boost on my shooting. And hey, green listen, giants. if I'm wide in the corner, it doesn't even matter if I'm contested. You know it's green, and you see that right there. You see this magical thing right below me? That is literally 2K telling the other team that it is game over. Time to pack your bags because the dude that has this sharpshooter takeover is not missing another shot. It is simple as that. This is the most overpowered take in the game. If you don't have this, green good giants. luck, big greens. You guys already know what was going to happen. Bro. And with this yo, like, I'm just gonna say it doesn't even matter if you're that crazy of a shooter If you have sharp take you are not gonna miss unless you take the most outlandish shot of all time You know kind of like this one because you know, you really don't Green know I'm giant. seriously though like Sharp takeover is too overpowered this year not gonna say it needs nerf But people that say you can't shoot in this game honestly need to make a new build get better badges or hey for an example Get a better jump shot that can even hit whites like that. Okay I hit whites greens anything in this game is gonna be cash if it comes from this jump shot And that is just a general consensus at this point everyone I've gave this jump shot has been able to hit with it So hey, why don't you guys try it and let me know how you guys feel about it you guys also need to realize that with jump shots this year, you need a jump shot with a high green window. Now you guys see whenever I shoot green shots like giants. this, whenever it's green, my window to hit the shot is so wide. Like in all honesty, the amount of whites that I hit is probably more than the greens that I shoot, and that is even without sharp take. For some reason, with this jump shot, with this base, I feel like you have a higher green winner percentage. Again, that could just be me being biased because it is my jump shot. Or there might actually be some facts towards it. I'm not totally sure. But I know here in this clip, I got out of pocket right now. And I tried to hit a ridiculous shot. But hey, you know, some shots don't go in. That was good timing, not gonna lie. But again, I clanked that one. I had to keep it in the video because, you know, I could have shot perfect for today's gameplay. But instead... I chose to try to jerk around and see what happened, and I missed the shot, so it's fine. You know, you're going to miss. I didn't want to have a perfect gameplay just to prove that you can miss, and I don't want to be one of those fake people to say you're going to make every single shot, because that's just not realistic. So again, man, hop into another gameplay. We ended up going on like a 30 game streak on the threes. It was something fierce, because even though this is not green, it is still green. The amount of whites, I am not going to keep saying this, but the amount of whites that I hit makes zero sense. It makes zero sense. You guys are going to see. Like, every shot that I hit, I I honestly think that this this jump shot has a tad bit of a glitch in it. Because, like, listen, okay, my boy needs the jump shot. I'm not going to cap. Green but I don't. Because it's green. No, but all jokes aside, you, again, you guys got to realize I have a 91.3 with all my badges. So this is going to look like I'm a god tier shooter. But to be honest, I have the stats and the badges. So this is just pretty easy. Um, I know a lot of you guys say that shooting is broke in this game, but just trust me, it all comes down to the build you use. In this game, it really is based off your stats and your badges. Um, you're not going to be really that consistent with like a 73. You can be, but like you're not going to have perfect games like how I'm shooting, and you can't really expect to do that because like I said, in this game, they're really making it based off whatever your build is. That's what you're going to be able to do. If you're made to play defense, you're going to be playing really good defense. If you're made to shoot, you're going to be a really good shooter. If you're like a pure playmaker, you're just going to be able to pass. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, there is nothing really else to that one. But, again, if, if you guys do make the Playmaker Shot Creator, I did post a build video on how to make mine in case you guys are interested. It's a pretty fire build, not going to lie. I do all right. I do all right. I got like a 91 percentage, and I hit a lot of shots. Like, I'm sure this is going to be green. Of course it is. Yep, green. But like I said, bro, this game is low-key too easy. Um... If you can shoot, it's really that simple. Just find a shooter, and you're just going to be able to hit shots. This is a white, fat clank. Not going to lie. I got too excited because it is so fun to shoot in this game. Dribbling is fun. 2K21 is honestly a fire game. I have so much fun whiting out, as you guys see. But in all seriousness, though, top tier game. It's probably my favorite 2K since 2K17. Let me know how you guys think if you guys are still watching this video about how 2K21 is for you. I'm really enjoying this game, bro, and I'm honestly thinking about grinding it. As long as I have teammates that can hit shots because my boy is broke. He needs the jump shot. Listen, Jason, if you're watching this video, hey, you know, just take the jump shot and we can go from there. All right? Hit the shot. Okay, fat white. But hey, it went in. We're good. <laughs> nah, again, I'm joking. But like I said, if you guys did enjoy the video, if you learned anything new, 
make sure to leave a like because that's low-key all I can ask for. Um, I'm not going to ask for a subscription ever. Hopefully, I can earn that. And if I did earn in today's video, then drop a subscription. If I didn't, then hey, it's all good. Sooner or later, I will earn that sub. If that green doesn't earn a sub, though, hey, I, I don't know what to say, you know? You know, I, I, it's fine. Everything's fine. I got the take. You guys know what's going to happen next. I should even have to explain what's about to happen. But you guys can just see it for yourself. Pulling up a hey, fat white. Just kidding. <laughs> Got gotcha. y'all. <laughs> nah, but again, if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like and as well subscribe. It's been your boy JJ2K. I am out. Peace.